I'm Paul Anastas. I'm a professor at Yale University, and I'm the director of the Center for Green Chemistry and Green Engineering at Yale. My name is Julie Zimmerman. I'm the Vice Provost for Planetary Solutions here at Yale. I'm a faculty member in the Environment School and the Engineering School, and I help lead the Center for Green Chemistry and Green Engineering. If you want to be part of designing tomorrow so that it's better than today, then you want to be part of the Certificate Program in Green Chemistry for Climate and Sustainability. This certificate will help professionals in the field do what they do better. So whether you think about how to grow food or how to move people and services or how to produce pharmaceuticals or how to write the policies that influence those things, you will be able to do that in the frame of green chemistry so that everything we're doing is to benefit people and the planet while also thinking about profitability. The program covers the concepts, the knowledge, the skills and the tools that you need in order to use green chemistry in solving some of the most pressing problems facing our world today. This program includes synchronous and asynchronous components. So you get the benefit of flexibility in terms of reading and doing assignments and watching videos on your own time. And then the interactive component that's real time with faculty and other students in the class. You'll be able to think about innovation from the science and the chemistry and the molecules to business and markets and how to use those levers to drive green chemistry. This certificate program offers so many opportunities once you complete it. Because chemistry, as we all know, is everything that we see, touch, and feel. Green chemistry is important because chemistry is everything. It's about looking at how nature produces chemicals and materials and trying to mimic that in our own industrial processes. The challenges that we're facing in the world around sustainability, climate change, biodiversity loss, resource depletion, all come down to the chemicals, the materials, the molecules that are the basis of our society and our economy. Green chemistry is not just understanding the problems, it's identifying and implementing the solutions. 